designing, engineering, and installing complete comfort systems. A good neighbor heating and cooling. And for a limited time, take advantage of a furnace and central air conditioning package installed for only $56 a month. A good neighbor heating and cooling since 1919. Ready to serve 24-7. Hi, Casey Hendrickson here with Michiana's Morning News. Ashley Banfield from CNN, she's a moron. Now, she was responding to something recently on one of her segments about Kansas pastor Curtis Knapp. Now, this is what Curtis Knapp had to say and why she actually led into the controversial comments that she made. He says, we punish pedophilia, we punish incest, we punish polygamy and various things. It's only homosexuality that is lifted out as an exemption. Well, here's what Ashley Banfield said live on CNN. We got, I mean, we got to outline here when he says they punish incest and pedophilia. Please. Those things are often not by choice and are crimes. Crazy. Homosexuality is a lifestyle choice by people. It is voluntary. Um, it just defies logic. It really does. Now, she's issued clarification. I want to read it for you just to be fair to her. In no way did I ever want to suggest that being gay is a choice. It is not. And I probably use the word lifestyle choice, not what I meant to say at all. Being gay is not a choice. Being in a voluntary gay relationship is a choice. But I really want to address what the pastor said. Now, Ashley, you, know, you guys can debate about whether or not she's an idiot on your own time. But Pastor Curtis Knapp from Kansas is, in fact, literally, by definition, a flippin' moron. Here's the thing. People are out there and they've been debating this, this gay issue forever. Is homosexuality a choice? Is it not a choice? Can we finally just come to the conclusion of what the facts really are? Sometimes it's a choice. Sometimes it's not. How about that? Forget everything else about it. Scientific evidence shows that some people are actually born gay. And when I was in school, I learned it. Their brain structure is physically different from the people who identify themselves as gay from birth than people who are heterosexual. That's a medical fact. It's not in dispute. I also personally know people who are gay and bisexual who have made the choice voluntarily. They weren't born that way. They simply said, enough is enough. I decide I like women, or I decide I like men. I know a couple of people that have made that choice. So can we just stop fighting about it and just come to the conclusion that, hey, some people make the choice, some people don't make the choice. I'm your host, Casey Hendrickson, for Michiana's Morning News. Make sure you tune in every weekday starting at 5.